16 Fence Road, Veronica Norell, Cool Ray Carrier Traffic Center. Okay, so we're going to northbound hitting the brake just before that old toll plaza staying solid all the way out to Holcomb Bridge. And then you're going to slow again over in Forsyth County from State Route 20 out to Highway 369, northwest mile of Martin McKay. Okay. Seeing delays on 75 northbound approaching I-285. Pretty tough through the construction zone in spots up to Chastain Road, 575 crowded leaving Town Center Mall. Still seeing delays with that bad crash in Cherokee County coming highway east of East Cherokee Drive. Triple Team Traffic, WSB. Okay, here we go. Last chance. The Buckhead Life 20% more promotion is over at the end of the month. Get 20% more on all Buckhead Life Ultimate Dining Cards. You can recharge an existing card and get that bonus, or you can go online to BuckheadRestaurants.com or just stop into one of the restaurants. All that deliciousness, great food, plus 20% more. Last chance only through the end of the month. Go to BuckheadRestaurants.com. Hey, you made it to his practice? Yeah, I used the express lane. Was he happy to see you? Thrilled. Held me on his shoulders as the other kids cheered. Okay, funny guy. So he was happy? He was happy. The I-75 South Metro Express lanes will open soon, so get your Peach Pass. And if you sign up before January 31st, you'll get $10 in free toll credits. Visit peachpass.com slash promo and get $10 in free tolls. That's peachpass.com slash promo. Heavy rain, strong winds, and damaging storms recently impacted North Georgia. How did your roof hold up? Heavy rains expose roof leaks that can lead to water damage. Schedule a free roof analysis from Dave Baker, trusted and recommended Findlay Roofing. Roofroof.com. From director Martin Scorsese, we must find Father Ferreira. The moment you search for danger, you step into high danger. In your search for a man, they uncover the mystery. Are you taking them? Critics nationwide call Silence one of the year's best films, and the Los Angeles Times declares it the best picture of the year. Andrew Garfield, Adam Driver, and Liam Neeson. Pray. I pray with your eyes open. Silence. Rated R. Now playing. At 423 WSB, got a brand new entry wreck to cap. Rock and Road at Highway 78. The downtown ride southbound is already about 40 minutes. Southbound Linux I-20. Northbound just under 20 minutes from I-20 up to the 8500 split. 20 eastbound is rugged after Wesley Chapel. The westbound delays of that wreck off to the right near the downtown connector. Slow again at Fulton Industrial Boulevard. Alex Williams, Cool Ray Carrier Traffic Center. 75 southbound. Typical slow zone between 25 and Forest Parkway. Then you're going to slow again through Stockbridge once you just hit that 675 merge. Delays continue down past Hudson Bridge. 85 southbound speed limit conditions leaving I-285 heading down towards Peachtree City, Doug. Traffic Trooper Tilly spots a brand new wreck at Oakwood, Thurman, Tanner at Bundy Mill Road. She also saw trouble at the median I-985 uh, around uh, the Bundy Mill area. Triple team traffic all afternoon, WSB. <laughs>
Washington, D.C., Donald Trump, the 45th president for the full hour tonight, Hannity on the Fox News Channel. There's hardly a topic we don't touch on, uh, so hopefully you can join us for that, set your DVR. We've got Bet in California. What's up, Bet? How are you? Yeah, Sean, this is Bet. Hi, thank you for taking my call. Yes, ma'am. Um, I, I just got done watching the GOP speech, and talk about unity. I'm so I'm so proud of everybody out there doing the best they can do, And but that's not really why I called. I called to vent from yesterday and the day before about the women's mark. They did not represent me, and now we're hearing more and more women are saying the exact same thing, which makes me happy. This march totally consisted of loud-mouth, immature crybabies that are sore losing Democrats. They are... You know, I, I, they are I'm not going to give it away, uh, but I asked him about Madonna's comments about, oh, I'm thinking about, I've thought seriously about blowing up the White House. I think you'll like his answer tonight. Good, great. Well, they are Trump haters. Many of them are non-voters. And Sean, some are probably illegal aliens, just to name a few. But they're just, these protesters are just starving for attention from TV and social far left media. And and um, they will never represent or be a voice for many of the peaceful, loving, intelligent, classy, and hardworking women in America. And there are many more of us than them. These immature vagina waving Democrats think it's okay to act up in public by raising their disgusting signs and speak out such vulgarity that in reality is far harsher than Trump's so-called locker room comments. This is asinine, asinine and I hope they grow up. As a gay woman, I suggest these protesters stop the hatred and we all should just stop watching the lies coming from the certain Democrat television channel. You know, let me just ask you, isn't it interesting that, you know, probably the most outspoken person against radical Islamic Sharia law are conservatives and people like me, and I keep pointing out they're killing innocent women and men that are gay and throwing them off roofs. And people say, well, you don't support changing the definition of marriage. I mean, where are your priorities here? You know, Hillary Clinton's taking money from countries that treat gays and lesbians this way. What is, what is your reaction to that? I heard all that. I don't know what they're listening to. And, and, and shame on them. I've learned so much just by listening to you and to Trump and to the history that Newt Gingrich, people are putting out there. It's out there. If you want to learn it, you can watch and learn it. If you don't like the source, go find something different. But they, this whole thing about the gay thing is, is crazy. It's crazy. Well, I can tell you most people, and I know, I, I think most people are pretty mature in thinking you're an adult, you live in a free society, and it's, it, you want to know about my sex life, really? Would you want to know about that? Who Probably not. Here, You know what? It's, I did they couldn't? Do you really think they followed those diets? Hey, you'd lose weight too if you had a personal chef and a trainer. Listen, these diet companies have been around for decades while Americans have gained more and more weight. They know you'll fail and blame yourself.